Hey guys, I'm super excited because multiple time world champion and renowned over under guard pass of Bernardo Fari is going to help me with my over under pass and you'll be able to see uh, the tips that he gives me. So Bernardo, I've been playing with the over under pass. I really like it because I'm old and I'm injured and I'm slow huh. and this pass works really well. You don't have to be super agile, you don't have to hop all over the place. So it works yeah, good for old guys. Yeah, I agree. Um, but I'm wondering if you could take me through it and then tell me what I'm doing wrong. There and, you go. You know, make me look like an idiot, but it'll help me and it'll help everyone else. There you so. go. Yeah, I, I, I consider myself kind of looking about that because uh, this position really works for the older grapplers. Mm -hmm. And uh, these are the guys who go to seminars, who, goes to, who does jiu-jitsu in the schools and that. So I didn't plan to have this game, but happened that... that that I, I, I have it, and now I'm really trying to take advantage of it. I'm really trying to sp spread it to everybody and help that, that demographic, like the, the old guys. And yeah. it, it's very cool to see, like, uh, many times I receive messages from people like, uh, oh, I do jiu-jitsu and your game works really well for me. And then I see the guy is really strong. And then, I mean, like, ah, but he's strong. But when I see some old guy, like 45 years old, 50 years old, 40 years old, sending a message saying that his game work, my game works really well for him, that he's stopping the young kids and that, that that's the message that I love to receive. And nowadays I'm receiving a bunch of messages like that, so very excited about it. It's a good thing you didn't base your guard passing off the cartwheel. I agree, I agree. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. So, I'm typically trying to force my way into this position, kind of like a half butterfly. And tell me if I'm get some kind of underhook here, get some kind of grip on the pants here, and then get this ear here. Excellent. Pike up. Very good. The uh, trouble I find sometimes is pushing that leg down. There you go, that's a great question. So two things I would do a little different here. Your elbow is a little bit too open, so okay. it gives me an easier way to go to the keyboard. So I would try to also get here, just focus about keeping our armpit over my leg. That's it. So now it's hard for me to get a keyboard. Now so gonna, I don't actually have to grab here? Not right now. Okay. Right now, just focus on do that. Now you're going to stay on toes and put your shoulder on my diaphragm. Yes. Now the key here is, if you try to stretch my leg down right now, you're going to give me the kibura and it's going to be hard for you. So don't do that right now. What I want you to do is, stay on toes again, shoulder on my bed, walk a little bit to your right side. Now is the time you're going to push. It's way easier okay. and you don't expose your elbow. Now what I want you to do is come back all the way down to the middle. That's it. And now we're going to skip my leg and pass using this shoulder pressure. That's great. It's okay. being tough for me here. Great job. Now climb up and go to my head. Very good. Very, very good. So now I'm finding one big problem for me. Yep. And sometimes it's just a question of patience is after I passed, is moving the hand from here up there because guys fight like crazy to stop that. That's arm. a great question. And uh, there are Maybe some, do it on this side here. There are some <laughs> options over there, and I'm gonna show you. So stay on toes, drive your to the side, stretch the leg down, skip and pass. Very good. When you got here, there are some things that can happen. Most basic thing would be you bring this arm to my head as you did. Okay. But many times when you try to do this, I go and block your arm over here, right? And then you cannot reach my head. What I would do if I was you, I would switch this hand palm down to my pants. These pants, yes. And now I would control my triceps with the other hand. Now imagine you want to open the curtain. And I'll come up. Oh, I yes. see. And this is going to bother me to recover with this leg. Doesn't right. make sense? Right. So you want to do it one more time? So I'm going like this. You kind of open the curtain. But you okay. got to make sure to have these pants. Because if not, I'm going to recover bringing my knee in. Okay. So try one so more time. Here, I've managed yes. to pass. Yes, and then you try to go to my head, you couldn't, and then I'll open. Yes, exactly. Look how it, I have nothing here. And now it switch to my head. Exactly. Very good. Okay. Does it make sense? Yes. Now, am I putting enough pressure on your diaphragm? I like it. And there is one little thing that you can do as well to help the pressure. You are doing like this. Pay attention on my legs. If you switch your base like this, Depression increases like exponentially. May I feel that, please? Yes, yeah, so let me do on you just for sure. Things I do for you guys. So, look, I'm here, right? That's the way you are doing. There's okay. pressure, but not too much, right? Now look at the difference. Oh, yeah. Can you feel yeah, it? Yeah, that's a lot so worse. Just because I switched my legs over there. 
and I'd ride on a diaphragm. And in this case, I would start driving, 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 stretch the legs out, and I'm gonna keep pushing, look. Okay. Does it make sense? It also makes it harder for me to keep that hook with the legs. Exactly. I can exactly. just switch that hip. So I would say here, like in this like, uh, mini lesson here that you did, three things that you could fix. One, keep the armpit closed, walk to the side, stretch the leg down, then come back to the mirror. Second thing was regardless to go to the head, I would control the triceps, control the pants, and open. And third thing, it's switch your leg. So let's do a quick review here on everything. Okay. So we go. So we're here. We're here. Yes. yes. Stay on toes. Very good. Walk to the side. Push my pants down. Walk all the way down to the view. Now remember about switch your leg a little bit. Mm. That's meant way more pressure. Way more pressure. Oh, okay. Now let's keep the leg over and get inside control. Good job. If I block your biceps, you're gonna control my triceps, control my pants. Look, I can't recover. And now I switch to the head. Very good. So, okay. yeah. This one is the, the, okay. the, tree, the tree details perfect. My viewers, thank you, and my training partners will, uh, will hate you. So it's perfect. <laughs> thank you so much, Bernardo. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks. My pleasure.